On a previous video, we talked about how important it is to block off or clamp off the brake hose before you push that piston back into the caliper because you're disturbing all that debris that could be inside that caliper and you're pushing it upstream right into the ABS unit. Well, in this video, I want to show you how small those passageways really are inside your ABS unit. Now, you can see the ABS unit itself is not too bad a size, but here's what we're going to look at. We're going to look at internally inside the ABS unit. I got this one half apart already here, and I pulled this one valve loose. Now, you can look close here. There's a screen on the bottom of that valve. The, the valve is actually internally inside here, but that screen will actually prevent that, that debris from getting trapped inside the ABS unit. But here's the problem. That screen will get eventually get clogged with that same debris. And the debris I'm talking about is not dirt. You know, it, this is a real example of some really dirty brake fluid. You might not see this. What you're going to see, though, in your caliper is the little small pieces of rubber that come off of the components inside the, inside the not only the ABS unit, but the master cylinder, the, the, the caliper itself. There's, squ there's square cut seals inside there. You're also going to see the corrosion that, that, that occurs on all the metal parts. All that goes downstream into that caliper. So when you push that piston in quickly and disturb and push it up, it'll push into the ABS unit. Now this is what they call an R-wall unit. This is strictly only controls the rear brakes, so it only has two valves. And this has an isolation valve and a dump valve. This was an easy one to take apart. So what I did here, let me show you. If you unscrew this, this right here is the dump valve. Now the little valve that fell out already there, just it just sits right in here and that little tip right there goes against this small little opening right here and those that's exactly how it can open close open close it, in this case here it it'll, it opens the accumulator close the accumulator open close open close and this open and close is about 10 times a second so it, it, it really needs to be clean no debris I'll take this apart here one more time just as a little light duty spring and the nose the tip of that right there is what actually seals that ABS unit so this I just wanted to show you this to kind of verify what we told you before that it's so important not to just push that piston into the caliper